Welcome. Today we're going to talk about Napkin AI. It's an interesting tool that helps to turn text into engaging content with a couple of clicks. In this video, I'm going to introduce this AI application, see some more examples and talk about the pros and cons. Without further ado, let's dig in. Napkin AI is a free tool which is currently in beta mode. What I really like about the home page is that it gives a clear overview of how the application works, how to use the application, the use cases. It gives you examples, what you can do with it. And also it shows uh, a feedback that they have received uh, for the application. To use the application, you need a registered account. Once you log in, you will have the option to create new napkins. You can either import your own text and get visuals for it, or use AI to start brainstorming. For this example, I've used the option to generate with AI and used the prompt how to write an essay. Once you click continue, the AI will automatically start to generate outlines uh, for the text for us. Now that the text has been generated, we can start to add visuals to it. Uh, moving next to the Topics gives us an opportunity to choose an icon for the text. All the icons and visuals that we have generated can be downloaded in three different formats. Also, the application gives you the opportunity to edit any of the visuals that you have created. You can choose the colors, the text look and more. If you move towards the text below heading, by clicking on the lightning button, it will start to turn text into sketches. This will give you plenty of choices to choose from. If you are not happy with the choices, there is a chance to generate uh, more. Once you have found the one that you like the most, click on it and the system will give you some more options regarding colors, fonts and so on. This can be done for each uh, of the paragraphs and the system will try to generate most suitable sketches for us based on the information that it has. Once you have found the sketch that you like the most, you can further work on it. You can either change colors on it, you can change the style, you can change the fonts and uh, find what suits you the most. Uh, also, you can choose the aspects ratio depending on where you want to present this uh, sketch. And as I mentioned earlier, all the sketches can be downloaded in three different uh, formats. And you can also choose between night mode or day mode. Napkin AI gives the opportunity to share your workspace so you can work on different projects with other people at the same time. Simply add the co-worker's email or copy the link. Alternatively, you can just download the PDF and share it this way. The application is available in different languages and you can always choose the page format that suits you the most. Now let's take a look at an example that I have created before using this AI. I prompted the AI to show me how to start a YouTube channel and all the sketches that you can see have been suggested by AI. All you have to do yourself is to edit uh, some of them to look more appealing. Conclusion, let's take a look at the pros and cons of this AI. The pros are that it's really easy to use, it helps to save time, it helps uh, with different ideas and sketches, uh, it's easy to integrate with other tools and the option for real-time collaboration. The cons are that the sketches may look too simplistic or lack creative depth. Uh, the collaboration may be chaotic. The internet dependency and data security due to being cloud-based tool. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.